was DJ Grace. A cold sweat hot and in this job. I throw my hands in the air, said, play me something. I'm going to see how this is Russell Nilly speaking. That's how DJ Grace, you know what I mean? Beat it, don't stop beat it. On the took off show. <laughs> Biggest by the show around town in London, you know what I mean? England, is it? Yeah. Welcome, welcome everybody to the interviews with DJ Grace took off boss. Please to share and please to invite, okay? The artist we have today for the interview, his name is Straight. Alright, so this is going to be an interesting interview. You don't want to miss it. So please share, invite. Thank you. We've been down for so long. Pour down, pour down like a falling rain It's a good to live good with each other It would be so happy to see us rise again Let's wise up and rise up each other I make our maker Pour down, pour down like a falling rain Rise up, falling children And take this time again And let your love come shine Shine like the sun shine Make love in the heat of the borders In rise civilization In this world again Come shine, shine like the sun will shine. Rise up, fall in children, and start focus again. I make your goodness rise, rise for us again. Goodness belong to all generations, and only us can make the goodness work again. Let's get wise. And please to invite, please to invite. It's the interview with the artist straight waiting on the artist to come on the live. Please to share in the meanwhile, all right? Big up on yourself. I, Sean. I, Israel. We've been down for so long. Rise up. Falling children, they take his time again. I make you 
your love pour down Pour down like a falling rain It's a good to live good with each other It's so happy to see you bright again Let's rise up and rise up each other And make our maker Welcome, welcome straight. How are you doing today? Welcome to the interviews with DJ Grace Tukabas. Good to see you today. How you are doing? Yeah, nice having you. Nice having you too. Yeah, I'm doing fine. You know, I'm doing fine. I'm home and it's getting chilly here in New York, just like over there in the UK. Right, I'm telling you, getting very chilly. Yeah. That's great. You could just introduce yourself to us, you know, um, and tell us why do you call yourself straight? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, bless up all the subscribers and viewers them out there. You know, my name is Straight. Well, officially family name is Kenneth Cunningham, but you know, my my artist name is Straight. Right. You know, so the street uh, it it just it's not the other day we get that name, you know, from childhood. You know, I was tall and slim growing up in the neighborhood. So, you know, <laughs> everybody wow. said, boy, this man is tall and straight. So it's just the people them give me the name and it just stick on me, you know. But I just realized it, the name is more than the name right now. It grew to be more than the name, you know. I just straight up with everything. That's all I can say about me. Well, well, that's that a good, me. that's a good one there. That's a good one there. Beautiful. Yeah. So how long have you been um doing music professionally? I should say. Well, professionally, you know. Professionally. Nineteen ninety-five. Wow. Nineteen ninety-five. Yeah. Yeah, professionally because once you run to record a song, you become a professional singer, you know. Definitely. <laughs> you know, uh, so 1995, I, I recorded a song called Informer. Sorry? I recorded, recorded a song. I recorded a song called Informer 1995. And oh, the really? swing is really, yeah. Can't take the informer, them not fit carry on ya, no, all them I try, we know so them I spy, yes, all them I try, oi, oi. we know so them I spy, people get up every day and they run off them out, but I know one day them lamp I go out. Double in the east, west, north, and the south, and a people business they want to talk about. In farmer, in that one sounds familiar. In farmer, in farmer. So, who first identify you as an artist? Well, a lot of people, you know, people in my community, you know, a lot of people recognize me as an artist coming up, you know. You have Nada Rounds, you have Cutty Rounds, you have Winnie Wanda, you have Johnny Ringo, you have a whole stream of them, you know, back in the days, at the early childhood days, downtown Kingston, I was learning trade and translating and, you know, that you Rye and I Rye and you have King Stitch and them guys, they used to, you know, we used to dare around them and them used to say, hey, you can be a singer here because you sound, you know. You can right. be a singer, but them time they, they themselves was trying to reach out there at that time. That's in the like the early, the early eighties, the late seventies, early eighties, yeah. You know, back then. So a lot of people really see me as a future artist at at that time. You know, so I just grow to to be one of them and <laughs> that's quite interesting beautiful yes. beautiful you know all right you know what let me 
have four songs I'm going to feature for you. Let me go ahead and feature the first one. It's called Rise Up. Let me play it again and then you tell us a little about this one. All right. All right. Big tune. Big tune. We've been down for so long. Rise up. everybody on the live big up yourself robert lang please to share everyone please to share please to invite tell us about this one straight yeah rise up falling children you know so long we've been in the dark you know and it's like we the people we're blind and 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 and, and we, we, we're still in the dark and we're not seeing what's going on no matter how much we we hope there you know in civilization right civilization yeah. is right there around us but then we've not civilized that much you know because we need love and we need togetherness and we need to rise up right car is like we're still falling you understand yeah. As yeah. Martin Garvey said, we're not going to know ourselves until we're back against the world. So we're still falling because a lot of people right now, in terms of poor people, right, black people, they're still down in the slum and it's like they don't know how to get out. So, you, you know, these songs motivate them to get up and go. Yeah. You know, just get up and go for the extra mile so we can you know we can we can preach love in every border every city yes. every country you see what i'm saying because that is one of the main thing where a lot of people shut up right now love because if you notice on the on the on the media a lot even the entertainers them they just keep fussing at each other, fussing at each other. You don't hear anybody say, hey, all right, let's let let let's, let's spread some love around here, you know? Yeah. Let's let's write, mm -hmm. let's open our eyes and see the the, the, the fullness of, of, of love and and, 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 and and elevate the younger generation them so that they can preach also preach love and obtain love in themselves across the border. You know, so rise of falling children is is a message to the to the world, to the young yes. to the youngster who don't realize that they're falling down. They need to get up and go and and face civilization. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Wonderfully yeah. said. Beautiful, I like that. I like that. So tell me, who are you? Um, who are you inspired by in the music business? 
but I was inspired by a lot of people, you know, coming up. Because when I realized that this music kick in, then I started to feature people like Neil Diamonds, you know, Kenny Rogers. I started to listen to those guys. I, I listened to Whitney Houston, uh, Dayan Warwick. I, I, I listened, you know, Beres Harmon, you know. I listened a whole bunch of artists and combined them together, listen to the yeah. pattern and style, what it, what it takes to be a singer and what kind of flavor you're going to put out there. You know, so I combine all of those together and then, you know, all of these icons out there, they inspired me to space that no one man or a two man. Everybody just inspired me to be a singer because, Beautiful. you know, you are there, you're, you're the singer. So I, I love to listen to even them singing at times, you know, and, 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 and it motivates me, you know. So all of these international stars out there, they, they inspire me a lot the music business. Definitely, definitely. So have you um have you done any collaborations? If yes, who it with who? If no, yeah. who do you like to do it with? I did I did a collaboration with Dan Mafia, you know. Oh the devil of Sunday. Yeah okay. and I did, I did nice. the devil of fight and I did teach with, with Dan Mafia. You know? Okay, hold the um let me hear a piece of that one. Dan, with Dan Mafia. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. The devil will fight, fight, fight. Because God in a life, yes. The devil will fight, fight. But he can't get me out. He my fight, fight. To me a travel and jar Go away, you know, she say you're confused. A long time, job blow your fuse. Go away, you know, she say you're confused. A long time, job blow your fuse. Every day you are trying, can't you get me confused? The devil want to see me in a bad mood. Go away, rude, you rude. Get lost, get out of my neighborhood. So I can live the life, just say I should. Rude, you rude, but you are fight, fight. You know, and that mafia come in with his part. So. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like it. Beautiful, beautiful. It's a so, of it, I didn't send it to you anyway, so that's all Okay. Right. So tell me, what has it been since you started doing music in the 90s and, and until now? How has it been for you? What is struggles has been like for you as an upcoming artist? You know, um, well, most of the time, you know, it's just, it click in your head. When am I gonna, when am I gonna be out there? When am I gonna start mm -hmm. a new song? Well, you know, um, so it, the only thing I could do in, in those, from that time to now, is just keep writing, writing songs, writing songs, because the life's journey is, you have to survive, so you're always stuck into a nine to five job, which right. keep you away, uh, keep you away from, from 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 music for a while, you know. So it's just uh, like a back and forth, and uh, you know. But it always in my brain to say, hey, as soon as I get a chance, I'm gonna vice, <laughs> you know. So. It, 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 it's 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 a moment where every artist, I, most artists, go through. I think, you know, where you want to be out there, but you don't get the chance to be out there. So you just keep <laughs> writing songs. You try to have some some ammunition. That's when you're ready to fight the war. <laughs> you know, you have to. definitely, definitely. <laughs> so you know, right <laughs> now I'm fully right now from that time till now. It's a journey. It's, it's, it's a hard road to travel and a mighty long way to go. But right now, I got it, you know, because I have Definitely. I have a lot of weapons right now can battle any. <laughs> yes, yeah. yes, definitely. Any I agree show, with you. From any rhythm now, I just feel good about the whole thing. And everything does a flow right now because um, 
soon as I finish this interview, I have an appointment for for the studio to go and voice a, a song again. So you know, it just keep going on and on, and I don't, I just don't let it go. I just keep on keeping on, you know. Beautiful. So are you working with um? A, are you working with a manager right now, or you're an independent artist? Let let us know. But right now is that I'm an independent artist. Call it that. I, I need a manager. <laughs> So, so anybody you know straight need a manager right so but other than that i have a um, producer in the uk there lady p lioness yeah mm -hmm. she did pretty good for me with you know with some tracks and uh, and i have an ep too called only one touch only she one put touch. Out that, yeah, she put mm -hmm. out that ep so other than she i don't have anyone else okay beautiful all right let me go ahead i'm going to feature another song this one is called another chance this yeah. is a beautiful song as well all right yeah <laughs> Songs. Well, you see that song, you know. Yes. That song, uh, the first song, the voice when we come to New York, you know. And yeah, when we come to New York, uh, the first song, the voice, and that is October 2020. So you know, it's last year we're talking about. Yeah, and after looking and. And the whole situation of life journey and and how vicious people are nowadays, you know. I just decided to just teach through music, you know. Yes. So I get all these inspiration writing songs from the most I God God. You know, I say, Father, listen, I need to teach these people because every day is like a liar, is like a Daniel in the lion's den, you know? And you know how it is. You in the lion den and the lions really can't bite you. And it's it's a scary kind of feeling to just go out on the road and and you know and it's just violence, violence, you know. So I'm saying to to God, listen, give me another chance. Because guess what? 
At right. the same time, when I'm telling, when I'm tell, when I'm writing that song and I'm telling God to give me another chance, I'm like, you know something. I have to live a certain kind of style for God to give me another chance, you know. And I don't want God to kill me, and I don't teach the people them what they're supposed to hear, you know. So that that was the whole the whole thing of me saying. Give me another chance to teach the right. youths right and wrong because the youths are getting out of hand right now. And you know, and most of the entertainer them, we don't know if I find them can find lyrics to put in the music them because the messages in the, in the music. And once the kids them hear certain kind of vibes, certain kind of sound, you know, <laughs> they gonna gravitate to it. So I'm saying that. Give me another chance, Father, to teach you right from wrong. The youth of today, yeah, and them go humble now, pray. I be a gunshot, them I take up every day. You know, people now take up the goodness. Definitely, nowadays. definitely, you're on the right track. Mm -hmm. yeah. The badness. So if we, the elders, can teach them, say, look here, you know. Don't do that because it's wrong. You know, you do if you do this, it will be better off for you. You know, so give me another chance. It's just like I'm telling God to give me another chance to flood the place with some roots, reality, yeah. and culture, <laughs> and let find the people in there. The message is really okay. Yeah. Beautiful. Say, so um, you say you want a manager to work with, so. If in case anyone out there is watching this interview, how can they locate you? That you well, know, can, that want to work with Craig. Well, they can get into me. They can get to me by my email, official straight five. Official straight five at gmail dot com. Or you can get in mm -hmm. touch with me one two nine four three five. Two four four five. That's my closest contact right now. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna feature another song, another good song. All your song them are good song, you know. <laughs> I love all your song them. All your song them are positive songs. This one is yeah, called man. New Sound. We understand. Yeah. <laughs> all right when we um after i play it and then you can talk about it all right new sound all right people all over this universe listen to this sound that comes with a surrounding sound Oh, yeah, yeah. 
To all the kings and queens, I see you coming in. Please to share the artist we are talking with is Straight. All right, Straight, <laughs> tell us about this one new song. Yeah, man, I mean, I mean, at this song, you know. <laughs> all, <laughs> right. They know all right, yeah, yeah. All of the, all of the viewers them out there, I am the song, right? Sound in uptown, downtown and all around, in a every villages and town, and, you know, and that sound there, it gonna eventually come in from the east, the west, the north, and the south, you know, you know. Sure, right, yes, sir. It was basically me and the sound, so I'm just telling the people themselves. People are gonna love the sound, and it's, it's, it's a holy sound, you know, cause my thing is a spiritual, musical journey, me depends still, you know. It's not like, you know, it's very spiritual. It's a spiritual mission me depend right now because I teach me, I teach. You understand? Anything can come with it, <laughs> but I teach me, I teach. And it, it, it's one of my greatest things when I want to achieve in my lifetime. To just put the sound out there. It is a new sound and me know people start love it all over them places they were here in the car already. Got them out there. <laughs> yeah. And them have Definitely. more to hear. You know, so basically the new mm -hmm. sound, the holy sound, is me. You know? Right. And I'm just so. pre Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's just me and the new sound. Right. So tell me what your support um, is like. Do your family support you? Your friends support your music? Tell us about that. Yeah, man, 100%, man. Them, them not play with me, man, because me have a nice personality where everybody love them, say. <laughs> sure. Definitely, yeah. definitely. Them, them personality is is good, not them present, you know, so people just love the vibes and know, say, why? I want to read this, you know. I want to read this from St. I want to read this from a little district, Matt you know. And, and I miss Cherry Sundays and the whole nine yard, you know. So all of these people, give, you know, my classmates, them and so on, them, them give me the energy, them, they, they, you know. Them, them support me a lot, you know, in the music mm -hmm. business. And that motivate me more. To just keep singing, <laughs> you know. Definitely, give them definitely. more. Yeah, you have to give them more because they, you know, they're looking forward for you to, you know, give them more every day. Definitely. So friends and family. We want to be they're looking forward to hear more from straight, of course. Of yeah, course. Definitely. So tell us, um, this pandemic, has this pandemic affect you in any way? Your music? Tell us about yeah. that. Well, you see, the pandemic, it slowed down a lot of things for, for everybody, you know, and especially the, the singers and players of, of the instruments. It slowed down a lot for us because if it wasn't for the pandemic, a lot of promoters would be featuring me already. But they cannot just put on a show right now because, you know, because of the crowd and the old pandemic situation, they have to just, you know, but it slowed me down a lot, you know, right. because people hearing my sound and people hearing my songs and, and they gravitate into it. 
So, you know, Definitely. the pandemic is a big impact from, from, from our, our music mission right now. Right. So have you ever get any chance to perform on any stage or anything like that? Have you ever been on any tours? Oh yeah, yeah. No, not tours, but local stage show. Um, local, local, you know. Local stage show. Not no major stage show. You know. Like um, I went to Jamaica a couple months ago and um, it was Marcus Garvey. Yeah. Marcus Garvey's birthday, and I went there. Right. I performed there, and you know, my friend will keep a little party, and I go there and I perform. Other than that, nothing really, you know. But I'm looking forward for the bigger cake. <laughs> Most definitely, yeah. of, of course, of course. Yeah. All right, let me have, have a question for you. If you could change one thing in the music industry, especially, you know, dancehall, are you a regular music, or even the, the um, yes, dancehall, what would that, what would you change if you could change one thing in the music industry? If I could change one thing in the music industry right now, I could change the fact that the slapness music <laughs> you know if i could change all those negative slapness gunshot and gun marrow and uh, and, and marrow fly out and if i could change that about the music you know and, and have them do more cultural music to teach the world you know and the young kids and that is coming up I would, uh, you know, I, I would, I would do that. If I could do that, I would do it. Ah, beautiful. I want you to, um, I want you to, to give a message right now to other upcoming artists, you know, who is viewing this interview. I want you to give them, if you have a word of encouragement for them, what will that be? Well, all the upcoming artists then, right now me is a young artist and i'm not established established out there like you know other international artists but all of the young artists then just keep a positive vibes in the music sing cultural music because people love to hear cultural music so that the kids then can gravitate to it you know just teach them the right and not the wrong you know because once them hear the wrong that generation gonna grow up with pure wrong wrong bar you know so all yeah. all the upcoming artists them the only thing is not much i have to say all you have to do just stay positive and sing positive songs and cultural songs to motivate the younger generation because the message is in the music and anything you put out here and then put it on the radio, the kids are going to gravitate to it. You know, people in general are going to gravitate right. to it. So just keep it positive out there and sing some good songs. Beautiful. I love that encouragement. Earlier you yes. said you were going to the studio after the interview. So, I'm, so yeah. I... That means you have a new song to voice. Do you mind, you know, give us a little piece of the new song that you're going to voice? Well, this is the song. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. I hope it's not a problem. Really? Because yeah. yeah. I'm going to pass on the song for the studio. Wow. Yeah. 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 All right. This new song that I'm going to voice, it's called Vision, you know, and it goes like this. I had a vision, and I'm going to share it with men and women, yes. Last night I had a vision, it's like a demonstration, it's like a congregation filled with celebration. You should have seen, oh, I'm on a bounce with some holy ones. 
and the spirit of Jah coming from all direction. Yes, people, it was a vision with no contention. It was a vision, a spiritual and holy one. It was a vision where we all sing in redemption song. A vision with love and harmony, spirituality filled the vicinity. No war, no brutality, thanks and praise unto the Almighty. Nothing but spirituality, glory, hallelujah, thanks and praise unto the Messiah. <laughs> yeah, it's all about all that. Right, so. right, took out the things. I like yeah. it, I like yeah. it. Nice one, nice one. <clears throat> so you have I'm a lot of song that you're working on. That's good, that's good. Yeah, yeah. We're looking song, forward no, to hear them. Yeah. Yeah, me have a lot of art song, man. Me have, you know, like pretty brown eye, but I'm changing the brown eye to, to bright eyes. You know, I have that on an original rhythm too. It's a cover, but, you know, it's a good flavor. You know, you have to, you have to kind of touch the bright eyes. You know, pretty mix bright up eyes. The uh, yeah. Thought you I want to listen to your computer that one? I told you I was in love before, then you came next door with your bright eyes. Oh, yes, 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 pretty bright eyes. Saw you from my window, my heart's keep a beat. I'm going to sit by my doorstep so that I can see you, pretty bright eyes. Please come out today so so I can tell you what I have to say, that I love you, I love you, pretty bright eyes. And every man in the neighborhood, they saying that you sure look good with your bright eyes. Oh yes, 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 pretty bright eyes. Saw you from my window, my heart's deep a beat. I'm I'm gonna sit by my doorstep so that I can see you pretty bright. Eye. You know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And so the rhythm. Wow. The rhythm. Yeah, the rhythm. Right. I like that one. I like that one. Very catchy. Sound like a hit. I like that one. Cultural. Everything is cultural, but you have to make sure you say you're out. It's ready for the ladies, them. Ready okay. for the ladies, them. And that's okay. because, you know, <laughs> them always, they are the front part of the stage, you know, so make sure you have a package for them, too. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Hold on a minute. Um, this, sorry. You know what? The one that called only, only one touch. For some reason, yeah. it's 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 ticketing a plane, and this is a good one as well, you know. So you maybe have to just give us the acapella, cause it's not yeah. plain, only one touch, you know. That's yeah. a good one, and then you can just tell us about it. Yeah, only one touch. Only one touch. Only one touch. Hey. Only one touch, and he can show you. Only one touch, and he become your friend. Only one touch, and there is no forgiveness. Only one touch, and the evil can show you. Hey, only one touch. Put you out of reality. Only one touch and you become addicted. Only one touch and you be you no more. Only one touch and the heat will control you. Hey, only one touch. Yeah, so <clears throat> doing it a cappella, it just 
like you're reviewing everything, but the rhythm combined with it, it's all about only one touch and it's all about the devil. Right. <laughs> you know? right. mm -hmm. the only one touch and he will control you. So you have to be careful how you approach certain things because certain things is for the devil. You understand? Only one touch because he will control you. And then you will be you no more when the evil control you. So it's all about, you know, the evil force. You know, if you try to grav gravitate to the evil force, it will gravitate to you and it will control you. So you cannot afford to give the devil that chance, you know. And and, and it, it goes for a lot of things. If you hook, if you get hooked on something, which is not good for you, you know. You know, it, it just can't show you. Mm, <laughs> so, true. Never be addicted, a, right? <laughs> yeah, so it's simple. You know, it's not no really long story about it. It just, you know, the evil will control you if you don't be careful. Definitely, I agree with you. I agree with you. So straight, yeah. is there um? Is there one thing that you want to tell us about straight that we don't already know and you think we should know? Well, straight is an ordinary guy who just go from home to work and coming back, you know. I have no relationship around town. I'm not married. Um, I separate, well, actually separated. You know, straight is just a single man now, and I'm kind of love the single, the single life right now because it it gives me more time to concentrate on on my foundation, which is dealing with this music here to put it out there. You know, because you know when you have a lot of people around you, sometimes it's good and it's bad. You understand? The goodness about it is that they can motivate. You understand, but with my people at the job, I kind of feel happy with them, you know. But the bad, this, the bad thing about it, you cannot concentrate on music sometimes when you have a lot of environment around you, which is very annoying and noisy. Yes, I agree. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's true. You have to have. You have, to, you, have to, you, have to, you have to concentrate a lot because right, when you write in a song sometimes, all four or five leads. Because as soon as you write, write the song and sing it over, you realize, oh, you know something? Let me take out this because take out this part and put in this part. And you need concentration to do all of that. You know, straight is a guy who goes straight with everything. You know, I love my straight. mommy and you know, it's not much to know about straight. And I just live live up a good life, and you know, everything just straight. Simple, right? <laughs> simple, simple. You know. Right. Beautiful. Yeah. How did you come across the two cam show again, straight? Social media. <laughs> social media and threw me in at the thing and I try to build a thing for myself, you know, and I say, hey, you know something, I'm a touch base with this lady, and I'm a touch base with this lady, but one I tell me, miss up from this lady, I'm in a year from this lady, and she's in a year from me. So my friend, my Jamaica, I sure got away, and he said, hey, <laughs> now give me a link. I'm going to give you a link for a lady um, at the UK, there, you know. She named DJ Grace. I'm saying, DJ, yeah, you know, DJ, <laughs> you know, but you know, so that's really how me get in touch with you officially by Sugar Wayne, Red Rockers, Rockers Red, yeah, definitely, definitely. Big up Sugar Wayne, yeah, man, definitely. a good man, good man, good man, Sugar Wayne, boy, I'm mm, a blaze, Mr. Every day, <laughs> right. Sugar Wayne said, where are you did there all this time with them song there? <laughs> right, yeah. right. Well, yeah, um, 
you are at a good place you are at a good place you understand most mm -hmm. definitely and um you are doing some good music and the world is going to hear about straight most definitely, definitely. all you got definitely. to do is just continue to push yourself because you're already on the right track doing some good positive music music that the people that need to hear right now you get what me i say yep. so just keep on pushing yourself to get what me i say really? you're on sister. the right track thank you. thank you very much for that encouragement there you know a motivation for me <laughs> yeah definitely definitely yeah. So straight at this time, do you want to say anything to the fans, to your fans? Do you want to give any special big up to anybody? Yeah, I just want to big up all of the fans and worldwide who you know, don't really know and you know, associate with but them know, them see me thing and them like it and them comment on it and big up to all of Uno and Uno family out there. You know, big up to my mother, Cherry. You know, in Saint and there, my sister, Diane, you know, <laughs> big up Jadi, the musician, can bong some bad really, you know, Jadi, yeah, big up Sugar Wee, and I'm big up you, sister Gracie, to make it possible to have me for your show, you know, definitely, enough, definitely. Love, respect, you know? enough respect to Dan Mafia and, you know, all of the people that work at the airport down at LaGuardia there. I straight say that, <laughs> say it. <laughs> you know, All right. so many names, so many names. It's just respect right around the world. Respect to Lady P. Lioness, Loaded, and the whole nine yard. You don't see me, I don't know me, I don't know the whole thing. Bless up on herself. <laughs> Definitely. And um, what I want to say to you is that continue doing your good positive music. Thank you. You understand me. I'm the queen of music, so you're at the right place. And you're doing well, the right song. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So pick up yourself, you understand? Just continue doing what you're doing. You understand? We love you on the Tukar show. As you say, you won't know everybody because your music is far and wide, but a lot of people yeah. know you more than you um you can imagine. You get what I'm saying? So yeah, keep on imagine. putting in the work. You get what I understand. Thank you very much to take the time out to come and talk with us. You understand? So the fans get familiar with you. See who yes. Trace is. You get what I yes. say. Yeah, so man, thank you. Definitely we thank, will. You for, thank you very much for having me and choose me as one of you know the guys that you need to interview. You know? Definitely. It was a great feeling, a great pleasure, you know. And I respect. <laughs> yeah. Right, so you are officially a uh, Tokav artist. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Definitely, definitely. So pick up yourself straight and, you know, you know, we will talk to you again in the near future. You understand? And mm -hmm. hopefully when mm -hmm. I talk to you again, you tell me, say, you've been on a couple shows and shell it down and all these yeah. good things and going on tours and all these good things and Africa no boy, US no boy, in ever man said world war no boy straight. You understand? Yeah. So no respect and big up yourself. Yeah man, respect man Hannah and respect to you. And guess what? Right. Uh, keep safe. Keep safe. You know, take care of yourself, sister Grace. Take care of yourself you. because it's only one grace, you know. So you have to Definitely. take care of the sister grace. Yeah. Right. It took one option. Sure. Sure. You we all are who no phenomenal. Sister Grace in the two car show. And he maturely reached right, left, and center, you know. Check out Sister Grace in the two car show. And I got me one the people and feel now. Let's up yourself, Sister Grace. Just remember that one when you go to the studio. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, man, man. I got All you. right. Take care. All right. All right. See you Bless later. Bye-bye. Thank All you. All right. Bye-bye. All right. I was straight, everybody. Nice talk with, not nice talking with straight.
to understand this. Now you get to see straight because they have been hearing his music over a week period. So big up to all of the queens and all the kings on the place. Nice to see you. All right, big up yourself, buddy at wax on the place. Big up yourself, uh, Robbie Steele, Miss Steele. Big up yourself, big up Jason, big up uh, Abado George. Big up yourself, Keith, and everybody else on the line. You understand what I'm saying? So enjoy the rest of your evening. Thanks for being here. And check out Straight Music. It's out there on our digital platform. All right, thank you. See you later. Bye.